Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. I'm Asha Etchison and I make videos here for actors and creators. So I know you're probably thinking, well, what does that have to do with hair? Well, as an actress of color, it's very important for me to be able to be versatile and to switch roles. And sometimes the things that I might feel is best for a character or is part of the character's breakdown is not something I'm willing to do to my natural hair. So my natural hair is actually down to my waist. I'm going to do videos on that uh, moving forward if anyone is interested, but Right now, um, I've actually been writing a character and she just has this very bad assassin vibe. And so my whole thing with her is I'm like, I want short hair. I want short, I want blonde, but I don't wanna do that to my own hair. So I'm actually excited today to be reviewing this wig. I've been wanting it for a really long time and I'm so happy I had a purpose for it, but it's Dara. Sorry for the light. So we have Dara Fashion Wig, Instant Fashion Wig. It says sensational style in 60 seconds. So I got it in 1B and 613. And you're supposed to be able to heat it up 350 degrees to 450 degrees. Um, that's that muffin cookie making heat. So that's pretty good. But yeah, I love this style and I wanna just see how this looks. All right, so first I'm going to start off with the 613. And this is like this really light, almost like yellowy kind of blonde. Okay. So I've never done a wig review before, so this is our first time together. Hello, how are you? But it has combs in the back. There's a comb back here. It has one comb in the front. I'm not sure how I feel about that, but we'll see. Then the lacing on the inside is not a lace front, but the lacing on the inside, sorry if my camera is blowing it all out of proportion. It's a little rough, but it's okay. All right, it's a little tight. Let's give it a try. So the way that I put my hair up under this cap is not how I usually do it. Usually I would kind of do like, I can't corn roll to save my life, but usually I would braid it off the scalp and then kind of wrap it around like a crown. So far it feels pretty decent. It's a little bit of shedding. It's not a lot. Yeah, it's not a lot. All right, all right, all right. Yeah. It feels very nice, very soft. It has a nice little shine to it. I've seen a lot of the shorter wigs lately um, made out of like human hair. This one, that's a little bit of a chunk. This one supposedly is not, that's supposedly like it's all fiber. Just want to play with it. Now, even though I love wigs, I am not the best when it comes to like full out styling them all over the place. Okay, you just want to smack me in the eye, all right? Like for me, I kind of just style them the way that I like it, and then that's the way that wig is forever. But I like like with this type of wig, you can do a whole bunch of different things with it. Okay, this is fine. This is cute. This is cute. Okay, wait a second, what do we got going on here? Like I said, guys, right now I'm just having fun, but I just wanted to show you this wig because I don't think I've really seen this shown on YouTube in this color. Like I've seen it in black and I've really liked it, but I've never really seen it in this color. And I was a little worried to get it. I wasn't sure how it would look. But I do feel like I need to sit in front of a mirror later on and like really play with it, really shape it to my face, see how it feels. But I like it. All right, so the next one that we have is the same one just in the one day. 
There's a lot of stiffness in the cap. I mean, it's not too much of a problem if you have your hair laid down properly, but the, the under lace for this is pretty stiff. This one almost feels a little smaller. Maybe I'm making it up, I don't know, but. I love when wigs like this have these little sides. Yes. Well, there's some hair caught under. I need to stop hitting myself in the eye. That's what I know. I like it. I, I really like it. I feel like they both have spy vibes that I was going for. <laughs> this is really cute i really like this and it really is versatile like i said i'm not much of a styler when it comes to wigs but if you know how to like style and move around or whatever like you will have a ball with this and look at all this volume look at all of that Now, when I actually move in to style it, I might cut some of this off just because it feels like when I'm swooping it down, it's a little like extra long, but I am loving this. <laughs> well, I don't really have much else to say. Um, like I said, this is my first wig, you know, review. I really do like this wig. It feels very nice, very silky, but not in... um like an extra fake type of way. Like it feels like a very well taken care of human hair. Um, I feel like it's very believable. I just love the way it feels. I love the way it looks. Um, I'm kind of just swooshing it wherever right now, but you can do so much with it as you saw. And I, I really do like this. I really look forward to using it. Wigs like these, um, I really appreciate the fact that they last a while. Like if you take care of it, it lasts a while. I probably wouldn't put any product on this. I would just leave it as it is. But I love to use wigs a lot in my work. Like I said, especially with my modeling, my acting, it really helps as you can see to like, just with the look, the face, um, just switch things up. That's my biggest thing. Like whether you are an actress or an artist or whether you just love hair and wigs, you know, I think it's important to have fun and not be put into a box, you know, not let anyone put you into a box. And I feel like wigs have given us the power to do that since the dawning of time. But <laughs> now more so than ever, I think that why not? Why not use it? Why not switch it up? And I love this. I feel like this could fit a lot of different roles, a lot of different types. It can even be um, for different eras, going back to the dream girl era, all of that stuff, you know. Did I choose the right one? Did I say the right era? You know what I mean. Um, I am really loving this wig and I feel like once I kind of break it in a little bit more for me, I'm really going to love it. But I would really appreciate your thoughts. You know, how do you feel about it? Would you rock something like this? Do you have something like this? Definitely let me know. Well, that's it. If you happen to like this video, please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. I would love to hear your thoughts and I would love for you to be a part of this journey. Take care.